The United Way needs your help to make sure the youngest neighbors in Trumbull County don't go hungry this holiday season. 27 First News reporter Amanda Smith takes a look at why the school food pantries need support. Over the last year, more than 10,000 students have visited food pantries in Warren City Schools, and the pantry at Willard Elementary is a very busy place. Kind of an open door policy every day when a child needs it or if a teacher sees that um, a child needs um, something for that day or if a parent calls and says, please let them go to the pantry, they come in. We probably 35 students a day come through the pantry. Oh, have, Michelle Sharo um, has worked at the schools for more than 20 years. She says having food available for kids to eat outside of school have, hours makes uh, a big difference. They come to school, they're worried how they're going to eat, how they're going to, you know, if they're going to have food, if they're going to be warm, you know, all those kind of things. So we want to make sure that we eliminate those barriers so that they can come to school and learn. The Willard Pantry stocks all the foods kids like to eat mac and cheese, applesauce, and an entire freezer full of frozen meat and veggies. The United Way wants to make sure those pantries stay filled. Having it available to them in an in-school setting is, has been really helpful. The schools discovered that comfortable fed children learn better and behave better. With the holidays approaching, the pantries will take a hit. Many of the children are going to be uh, loading up extra food, so they do have food over the Christmas break. In some cases, uh, the food pantries at the schools are the only place they have the ability to do that. And the last thing the schools want are empty shelves. In Warren, Amanda Smith, WKBN 27 First News.